This is the Z95 Headhunter. It's a 373-piece snub fighter that released in 2013 as part of the Clone Wars theme. Featuring amazing minifigures and top-tier aesthetics, this Headhunter is an essential Clone Wars set. Right away, the design and overall look of the set is top-notch. The sleek, dagger-like look of the Headhunter translates perfectly to LEGO, and the designer really pulled this off nicely. I love the dark red bricks used here on the nose, as well as accented along the wings and engines. The smooth black trim along the body looks amazing as well, and really ties the model together. Even from side profile, the ship maintains its slim aesthetics while still looking finished. Included with the fighter are three minifigures from the Umbaran arc of the Clone Wars series. The standout figure here is the evil General Pong Krell, who towers over the clones with his large molded torso and four arms. You also get a Phase 2 501st Legion Trooper with the Clone Wars style eyes, and a very cool 501st Legion Clone Trooper pilot that is exclusive to this set. Hello there. The pilot features a printed helmet and fits perfectly into the one figure cockpit. Behind the cockpit is a slide out piece that can hold a minifigure weapon or accessory. This also houses the firing pin for the integrated Technic Cannon, which folds out from underneath the model. Activating this black piece releases the missile, which can easily knock over a minifigure. <laughs> For an original MSRP of $49.99 USD or $39.99 Euro, this is a solid Clone Wars set that fits nicely with the theme. LEGO recommends this set for age 8 to 14 builders, but any Clone Wars fan can appreciate the Headhunter's sleek design and the excellent exclusive minifigures. Please like and subscribe and comment below your thoughts on the Z95 Headhunter. Thanks for stopping by.